This story is called Angus Lost, and it's another by Marjorie Flack. And I like this story because it features a person called the Milkman. And I'm old enough to remember that uh, when I was growing up, there was a dairy in our, ha in our hometown that had a milk delivery. And early in the morning, somebody would come out, drive out to the house, drop off uh, some milk in our milk box. We had an insulated box and it was somebody's responsibility to uh, uh, pick it up and put it in the refrigerator early in the morning. So I can't believe that that actually made sense back then, but this was a world before convenience stores and other things like that. So yeah, Angus lost. When winter comes, Angus grew tired of this same yard and the same house and the same cat and all the same things he knew all about. Angus was curious about other things in other places, such as where the milkman, there's actually more than one of them, came from and where the wide road went to and what kind of animal cars are and things like that. So one day, Angus slipped through the gate and... There he was on the wide road. Angus looked up the road and he could see no end. Angus looked down the road and he could see no end. Then another dog came by. Woof, said Angus. Gruff, said the other dog. Angus and the other dog ran together up the wide road. Faster ran the other dog, faster ran Angus, but Angus's legs were too short. Faster ran the other dog, faster ran Angus, but the other dog's legs were too long. Around the corner ran the other dog, around the corner ran Angus, but the other dog was gone. Instead, there stood a stranger. Woof, said Angus. Bah, said the goat. Woof, woof, said Angus, but... Down went the head of the goat, and its horns were coming close, closer to Angus when the goat stopped just in time. But zoom came a car coming at Angus. Woof, said Angus. Honk, said the car. Woof, said Angus. And the car ran away. Then dark began to come, and Angus saw two eyes looking from a tree. Woof, said Angus, and whoo, whoo, called the eyes. And Angus ran to find his house, but snow came, and wind came, and into a cave crawled Angus, and he waited, and waited, and waited until day came. Rattle, rattle, clank, clank, clink, clink. There was the milkman. Rattle, rattle, clink, clink, patter, patter. Angus followed the milkman. From door to door, from door to door. See, they didn't have insulated bottles. I'm, I'm old enough to see a change in this technology. From door to door until, at last, Angus was home again. Angus was glad to be back, to come back to the same yard and the same house and the same cat and the same things he knew all about.